got here. Well, that took me three hours and 20 minutes to get here. It's not bad, I had pretty good weather. Although I'm looking forward to some faster times. When I get these batteries. All right. Oh. That's a pretty full boat. Let's get our butts out of here. Oh my gosh, right there. I see that box it says Redodo on it. That means that is a big battery right there. Oh yeah. And there's another one in there. And the two of those are going on the shark slicer, which is now known as the tiger shark slicer, I believe, since it has tiger stripes on it. And then I also have a charge controller. Oh, and a pair of really cool seats. Oh, okay, I'll get, I'll get all this stuff out when I get home. Oh, that's gonna be exciting. Oh, I'm excited about these. So yesterday, when I went to pick these up, I was driving a solar pedal boat that has no batteries. And I got really lucky. I had full sun almost the whole way there and back, which doesn't happen that often. I think I had like a 30 second spot where there was a cloud in the way, but otherwise it was blue skies, uh, which is great. And my legs are still a little bit sore, but I got there in pretty good time. What is this? I'm gonna have to actually, okay, tear me off. Hi here, or your post bolts. Oh, okay, cool. Um, but one thing that would be really nice, oh, look at that. Oh man, that is a nice looking battery. One thing that would be really nice would be to be able to go to town earlier in the morning so that I'm not rushing around in the daytime. Huh, cool. I gotta pull one of these out. Man, these look nice. Oh, it's surprising how light these are. I'm expecting it to be like lead acid batteries, but uh, I think these are 50 pounds. Yeah, it's not that heavy. So what I often do is I'll leave to go to town early in the morning, which means I'm driving in the dark. Uh, so that means I have no motor help at all. However, with some batteries, that means I can leave as early as I want and get to town, you know, when stores open, not be rushing around so much. That'll be great. And I did do a bit of calculating and on these batteries, on two of them, I should be able to do a one-way trip to town without any sun, no charging at all, no problem. I can probably actually get there and maybe not all the way back. Maybe if I drove slower. And that's, that's kind of crazy to think that these two boxes can drive like a 30 foot boat, like a 10 meter boat, all the way to town and like halfway back. How, how, do, these, how do you get so much energy into something like this? It's crazy. I think people take that for granted, <laughs> but it's, it's incredible how much energy is stored in one of these things. So they're 25.6 volts. That's eh, like 24-ish volts, you know. 100 amp hours, and my motor, if I remember correctly, uses about 50, uh, 50 amps. So if I have 200 amp hours total, divided by 50 amps, I end up with four hours. So I should be able to drive for four hours, pretty much like full speed. That's crazy. Maybe a little bit less, a little bit less than four hours. So I think it's a, it's a bit over 50. Uh, 50 amps. Although I can just turn down the speed a little. And um, a funny thing about boats is that <clears throat> to double your speed, you have to like eight times the amount of power. So you can you can cut your cut the power you're using in half, and you're not going to go half the speed. You're going to end up going like three quarters of your speed. So yeah, if I if I if I drive at half power, I can still go three quarters of of maximum speed probably and uh, drive all the way to town and back with no no sun at all not that I want to drive around in no sun I always try to drive in the sun but it'll be really nice to be able to drive to town in the dark you know get up at 4 a.m. which I sometimes do anyway uh, but just having having the battery help will be nice 
Because even, even when I have a lot of energy, my legs are still pretty tired the next day. Because I always pedal even, even when I have the motor going. And uh, yeah, today I'm, today I'm a little worn out, but I feel good. I'm probably rambling a little bit because, uh, yeah, my brains are a bit scrambled just from, from the exhaustion of yesterday. Anyway, I want to I get these put in the boat. Uh, let, me just, let me just check the voltage on them real quick. They, they come charged, I think. Let me just check that. And you know what? While I'm, while I'm doing this, let's get these post bolts out. Do I need any instructions for this? This should be pretty self-explanatory, right? I get four post bolts with one. I only need two, right? Do they just give me extra ones? I guess they just give me extra ones, just in case. Is there nowhere else to attach the other two? Sweet, I think I just got some free stainless bolts. I think those are stainless. Nice. Another cool thing about this company, actually, is they've been very good in terms of um, customer service. Like they gave, this one has three bolts. Oh no, it has four. Yep, it has four. <laughs> um, like they've been very good at communication. Like uh, they told, they gave me the instructions on how to connect two batteries. You know, to make sure. I mean, it's basically you charge one fully, then charge the other one fully, and then don't, don't quote me on this. I'll have to double check the thing. But then you connect them in parallel to each other just to make sure the energy levels or the voltage levels are are leveled out. And then you can connect them into your system. You just don't want to connect them when they're, uh, you know, radically different voltages because, you know, they'll be shooting electricity from one to the other. It might melt something or whatever. Um, but yeah, every time I've sent them an email, they've, they've responded quick, which is really cool. All right, I think I'm going to shut up. I'm excited to get these in the boat. This is, oh yeah, I wanted to check the voltage. Let's see. These uh, kind of sat in the warehouse for a while because they had to get shipped to here. Okay, 26.4 volts. Well, that one's pretty charged. 26.4 volts, beauty. Oh, they're both, they're both holding their energy very nicely. That's great. Oh, I'm excited to get these put in. All right, I'm gonna go install these suckers.